Welcome to Quick Car Review. Our test car today is the Mercedes AMG GTS. This car features a V8 4 liter engine and that delivers 650 newton meters of torque and 510 brake horsepower and all of that to the rear axle. So, this really is a pure powerhouse and provides you with loads of fun while driving it. If you look at the exterior of this car, for me the first impression was like, wow, this really is sex on wheels. If you look at the front of the car, it's so massive, so wide, and then you see this long hood, and I think the whole car tells you, get out of my way. Going to the side of the car, you see these big wheels, this short overhang, this long hood, and this really is a beautiful shape and the whole car looks very flat on the road and this is because it is less than 1 meter 30 high. So the rear of the car is dominated by the big shoulders and the rear spoiler but you see these very nicely shaped uh, tail lights and these big exhausts and every single piece of this rear side of the car tells you yes I am a sports car. The interior of the car is absolutely beautiful perfect craftsmanship great materials and to be really honest it looks a lot more like a cockpit of a jet plane than of a car everything here is absolutely drivers focused you have everything you need for really safe and fast driving with its powerful engine and a seven speed automatic gearbox on board the amg gts accelerates in only 3.8 seconds from 0 to 100 km or 60 miles per hour top speed is limited at 310 km per hour a while ago i was lucky enough to drive this car on a racetrack and i can tell you there it really shows what it's capable of and nothing we did there you can do on an open road it's, it's absolutely fabulous to see what this car can deliver in a safe environment the car offers different drive modes from comfort to sport sport plus and race and if you want you can have an have a setup for an individual program as well and i can tell you even in comfort this car is already a sports car if you use sport or sport plus you really wake up the beast and then if you drive in race you're really on your own everything that may help you staying on the road will be just off so then you really have the pure car but i would suggest only do this on a racetrack if you want to let know other people what your car can deliver you should use sport or sport plus and you should use the exhaust button and then do this isn't this a beautiful sound this sounds like a sports car what i really like with the amg gts is every single piece of this car tells you it is a sports car it is the first impression the look of the car as well as the interior how you sit in it the sound the numbers everything tells you this is a sports car so if you're looking for a sports car that could be the car you want if you're looking for a car that is comfortable and could do some sporty things that's the wrong choice this really is a sports car and it always shouts at you drive me drive me fast but on the other hand if you like this this is absolutely fabulous the only thing that keeps me away from having one of these cars is the money i think you can easily spend 130 to 150 thousand or more for a well-equipped amg gts but i can tell you honestly i think it's worth every single penny driving this car on a motorway is a special experience because if you accelerate with this here from let's say 180 kilometers per hour to 250 it feels like with your standard car from 0 to 70 it's so quick but it's absolutely fabulous because it makes this and you're above 200 really great fun My name is Lars and that was my review about the AMG GTS. I'm really looking forward to your comments, so let us know what we can do better because only then we can approve.